Jervis, Record Test Module 46. Hope this time it will work. Hey guys, welcome back to Filmora Course Season 3 Superhero Special and in today's episode we are trying to recreate Iron Man flying. So first record a video like this. Pretend like you are firing up the blasters in your hand and shoes and then flying away. For the editing, we will be using Wondershare Filmora 13 which has all the resources to create graphics intensive videos like this. Take a screenshot of the blank space as well which will be required later. It has been added to the project media. Now move the player to the position when Iron Man is about to fly. That is when blasters will fire. Split the clip into two. Move it one layer up. Then put the screenshot at the bottom layer. Match the length. Next select the upper video that is with the Iron Man. Then double click. Open the video tab, then AI tools. Here there is an AI tool called Smart Cutout with which you can remove the background from the person. So we will do that. Set the brush size and roughly select the person. With the help of artificial intelligence, it can detect the object and remove the background from it. So add some edge thickness and edge feather. Click to start Smart Cutout. So the background has been removed. If you hide the lower layer, then you can clearly see. Now using keyframe animation, we will animate flying. So move the playhead a little, then increase the Y axis value, which will move the video up. We will add a keyframe here, then move the playhead to the beginning of the clip and we will restore the original position. So we have made the animation just like that. Next, go to the sticker tab and look for fire stickers. So this is the sticker we used. Place it in the timeline in the right place. Then resize it, rotate it and make it look like it's coming out from the blasters in my hand. You can zoom in the video player for better accuracy. Create a duplicate of this sticker layer by pressing and holding the Alt and Ctrl keys then dragging it up. Change the position of the fire blaster in the duplicate layer and place it under other hand. Now as the superhero is going up, the fire stickers will also go up. So using keyframe animations, we will do that just like the way I showed you before. So this is how it looks now. Two more of this sticker will be placed under the shoe. The reason I am placing the fire sticker at a lower track is because it should not cover the shoes. It should look like it's coming out from the bottom of my shoes. So this is the result. Now let's go to the end and here also we will do the keyframe animation for the flying away part for all the layers. Once that's done, go to the effects tab and look for the effect extreme. This will add the shake effect. Next we will apply the sound effect. So go to the sound tab, then sound effects, search for rocket. Let's add this sound. For the flying away part at the end, we will use this explosion sound. Again go to the stickers tab, search for tech. This is the sticker I used. I also added this sci-fi data reading sound effect. I also added a short speech at the beginning. So let's add a text field here. Then add the script. Right click, go to text to speech. I used a voice model from news category. So let's generate. Jervis, record test module 46. Now delete the text. So this is how I created this awesome video. I hope that it was interesting. Check the description for the full Filmora course playlist. Jervis, record test module 46. Hope this time it will work.